and today we're going to be talking about the secrets to how to increase webinar and workshop attendance because I know how important this is I know how you want people to show up for your webinar and you want you put all this time into putting slides together and so you want people to actually see what you're doing be there to you know to experience and so that you can teach them all the wonderful things that you you know so uh tonight or on tonight what look what i'm saying today is that i am going to show you exactly the steps on how to get more um more people to attend your webinar So we are at, we got two minutes. I think my clock on my phone has slowed down. But anywho, isn't that awesome that you can see full screen? So as you guys are coming in today, we're going to talk about the secrets to how to increase your webinar and workshop attendance. And so I'm going to walk you through uh, exactly what the Lady Boss members are going to get. So you are invited to a very special training that is only for my Lady Boss Club members, but I am opening it up so you guys can experience this awesome training, and I can show you also what's all included inside of the Lady Boss Club, okay? So we should be starting in about one minute. I'm going to get a drink of I'm gonna get a drink of water. Hey, Shane, how you doing, girl? Thank you for joining me. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so it is two o'clock. So let's dive right into to the secrets to how to increase your webinar and website attendance. I'm Elise Michelle Jones. For those of you who do not know, I am a certified online marketing expert and the founder of the Lady Boss Club. And so today's marketing meeting agenda, I am going to walk you through how to maximize the power of webinars and workshops using the five essential strategies that will help you attract not just more people, but the right clients. And you, these are the right clients, the ones who will see the benefits of what you have to offer and will sign up to be your client. That is what these five essential strategies are going to help you do today. So that's our agenda for today. So before I go into it, I want to share with you before I, you know, really got a handle on webinars and workshops this is my first webinar i ever did right and it was creative business solution and i created this little graphic and it's a register for my next free webinar and this is me looking all crazy with these crazy glasses and this like jerry curl hair that i had <laughs> but guys when i first did my first webinar uh in really my live workshop nobody showed up nobody and can you imagine how embarrassing that was i put all of this hard work into creating these slides and getting into can you guys see my slides okay let me refresh my page nobody showed up and it was really super embarrassing right because i put so much time into this webinar slides I created all the graphics, I got the transitions ready, I got my water, I got everything set up. And let's not talk about the live event. You guys know when you do a live workshop somewhere, you got to get the, uh, the, the facility, you got to get the chair set up, you got to have people help you, you know, when people come in, you got to get a little snack. But I'm going to tell you, on both of those events, my webinar and my workshop, nobody showed up. Nobody. The only person that showed up was my husband and me. <laughs> and my intern, that's right, my intern at my live workshop. So it was really embarrassing. But eventually I finally figured it out and I came up and these are the five strategies I'm going to share with you. So here are uh, two of my webinars that I've done uh, recently, how to create a flawless brand and the six things to do before you launch your coaching uh, consulting business. 
so far those webinars i did very well i have people who actually show up who stay to the end and actually buy what i'm offering or sign up to what i am offering at the end <laughs> And also, my live events have been very, very successful now. Uh, I've gotten it, you know, I know what to say. I know the strategies to bring people in so that they actually show up. So what you're seeing right now, you see one of my Lady Boss socials that I've done, um, an actual workshop, a three-day workshop, and then an event that someone else invited me to, to go and speak. So once you get this webinar workshop things figured out, other people are going to start to invite you to come and speak to their group of people also so then you get to offer what you're selling to them and get new clients because every time i do these events i always get new clients every single time so let's get started i want you guys to be able to grab uh your notebook and pen and take some notes because i'm going to be sharing some nuggets with you and i don't want you to miss anything okay so let me know if you're ready go ahead and put yes i am ready yes 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 i am ready put it in the comments for me let me see if i can make sure i can see y'all's comments yes yes awesome awesome hey everyone hey nicole hey latoya hey miss wecker wecker I want to say Deanna, if I'm saying that right, let me know if I'm saying that right. All right, so let's get started. All right, so strategy number one, when it comes to getting more people to attend your webinars and your workshop, is that you want to make sure your topics sizzle. I mean, sizzle, 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 right? You want your topics to be things that people actually want to attend. So finding topics that people want answers to is essential a lot of times we have these workshops that we you know we come up with cutesy little titles but are we really creating workshops that people actually want to attend so it is vital if you want to create a high value attended attracted audience and attracting webinars and workshops that people want that do not want to miss you want to do that you want to create workshops and webinars that are attractive that people do not want to miss a single word of it so where do you find these topics what i've done and what has helped me find a lot of my topics that people want to know is that i actually ask questions inside of groups so there are tons of groups that most of us join some of us that we didn't realize that we've been part of but ask questions of people and ask them what is it that they're struggling with what are some of the questions that they have and maybe sometimes i've even cheated a little bit and i've saw that other people have asked questions inside of groups and i've looked at all the questions you know the answer or questions that people have written under other people's posts and guess what i copy those into a document and then i go back to them and i create webinars answering those questions okay so that to me has been one of the easiest ways to find topics that people actually want to know. The second way you can do that is that you can actually research popular topics on Pinterest and Amazon. If there's a book out there, okay, that someone has created, that means that they are addressing someone's question when they created that book. And Pinterest always has great posts that you've seen. A lot of people who've been sharing or they're, they're pinned to their boards, that lets you know that that is also a popular topic that people want to know about that you can easily turn into a webinar and then you know another way i don't know about you guys but i get a ton of magazines that come to the house look inside of the magazines the magazines have done the research for you and they have done the research that relates to the target market that actually buys the magazines so if they're writing articles about it they know that their readers want to know about this subject matter so you can actually take one of those articles and turn them into a webinar, guys, along with online news sites also like BuzzFeed. So these are three ways that you can easily find topics for your webinar, right? Thank you for the thumbs up. Awesome. So in the done for you, uh, in my done for you marketing services, the Lady Boss Club, inside of that, you get a workshop webinar content. You get all of this done for you. And you get the, the the best of both worlds, right? With this done for you workshop slash webinar content. 
because you can use this webinar as a free lead generation, right? A webinar that create, creates a lot of buzz and really, really works. And because these webinars and workshops that I create inside of the Lady Boss Club are topics that people are asking for. They want to learn how to brand. So this is this month's new marketing package called Brand Like a Boss. Because there are so many people asking about how do I brand? How do I brand my business? Okay. So in this done for you workshop and webinar, you can actually provide this for them. You can provide the answers to them and I've created it all for you. You can also take this, once you've recorded it, you can package it up and resell it. Okay, you can sell it then afterwards. You can also use this workshop and webinar at live event. Okay, so if you're doing a live event and you're presenting, and they have a PowerPoint screen, you can easily pop this up here and you can go straight through everything because I, I provide the outline for you too to know exactly what to say for each and every one of these slides. And at the end, if you want to give a little bit more enticing for people to make sure that they join, you can also add a limited time on how long the webinar is available free, right? And this gets them to actually take action and want to watch it or they get a chance to watch it free before they have to pay to watch it, okay? So you can use this as a lead generator and you can also use it as a final product that you can use in your business and you can sell as a digital download or you can also use it as a, if you're doing a live workshop at someone else's event. And if, even if they don't have a PowerPoint slide, like they don't have a screen that you can do a PowerPoint slide, the outline that I provide that goes along with this it will also help you if you do a live presentation in front of someone and you know you you have to use your notes okay so this is in the lady boss club this brand like the boss brand like a boss is this month's marketing package and it includes the webinar slides and it also includes the outline presentator for the presentator so that they can know exactly what to say for each and every single one of the slides so strategy number two you want to include a high value bonus gift, okay? You want to include something that gets people to say, now, I've got to attend that. That sounds interesting. And I want that little free download. I want that free gift. So bonus gift ideas that people just like gravitate to, including myself, is you can include, and you know, like at the end of this webinar, I can say, hey guys, you can get my whole entire slide deck. You can have this slide deck that you can reference to and take notes, that, you know, to help enforce your notes. So me giving you my slides to this webinar is considered the bonus gift. That's a slide deck. The second type of bonus gift that people just absolutely love. Sometimes some people don't even watch the webinar. They just download the worksheets and work through them. So uh, if you include worksheets or a workbook that people can walk through the process with you during the webinar, that is a bonus gift that people just die for and you get them to easily opt in to attend your webinar. The last time type of bonus gift is that they can actually get the replay. Now for you guys, you know, I'm so glad you're attending with me, you're on with me, this is awesome, but you might have to step away, right? You might miss some of this stuff. But note that you will get the replay of this uh, training so that you can watch at your own time, at your own leisure time, that maybe you can stop and pause, you can look at stuff, maybe you can go and cook, but you're going to get the replay. My Lady Boss members now, you guys get the replay for, you know, whenever you want to, but those of you who are watching it for free, you're only going to have 24 hours to watch the replay, okay? So take note of that. My Lady Boss members who are watching now, you guys, you know, you get all of this. So in the done for you um, part of my, of the Lady Boss Club marketing package for this month, you also get bonus gifts, okay? So the bonus gift inside of, the, of this month's Lady Boss Club done for you marketing package is worksheets. Worksheets, guys. Yes. And you get the slide deck. So you can also provide the slide deck. So I've created worksheets that you can rebrand as you own, as your own. So when you're providing these little bonus gifts, don't tell your potential attendees what the gift is, but tell them how this worksheet is going to help them. 
So one of the things that I say when I include worksheets inside of my webinar is that I say I'm including worksheets so that you can follow along with me as I am presenting. Or I also use worksheets as the, the worksheets that I'm providing for you are going to enhance what I am teaching you in the webinar so that you can do this on your own without the webinar slides or when after the webinar is over with. So I make sure that the worksheets are enhancements. And one of the things that I learned as an educator, if you guys don't know, I've been teaching at the college level for over, I, mean, I think I'm at 18 or 19 years now. And one of the things that my students absolutely love are worksheets. They always ask me like, Miss Kim, where's our worksheet? Where's our handout? I need to follow along with you or I need to make sure I take good notes. And your, your worksheets always help me with that. So if my students love them, which they are adults, your students or people who are going to attend your work, uh, webinar and workshop are also going to, um, to love them also. Worksheets at live events are very, very important because it keeps the people in the audience paying attention. And they know that you have a handout that they can walk through the whole process with you. They're going to remember every single thing that you said on that stage. And they're going to approach you at the end of that seminar and want to hire you as a client or sign up for whatever your bonus is or buy whatever you're offering. And one of my, I know guys, I'm like talking like, like crazy, but one of my live events that I did, I think like a couple of months ago, I had a handout, right? Very simple handout and that people could follow along with me. Guys, everybody who approached me that day told me that my presentation was the best. And I honestly, I didn't, I didn't do anything great. You know, I didn't do anything any different than anybody else. But the one thing that I did do was that every single body in that audience had a handout to follow along with me and take notes. And they were writing feverishly, right? No one was getting up to go to the bathroom. They were paying attention to every single thing that I said. So note that worksheets are very important. And inside the Lady Boss uh, Club marketing, Dump you marketing, I include the worksheets for each and every single webinar that I provide monthly. Okay? So bonus gifts will also enhance what you teach in your webinar. I just said that, right? Something that will transform the teaching as well as your attendees. I mean, literally, people who had the worksheets in my live event, they could literally re like revamp or reset every recap. That's the word I want to say. They can recap every single thing that I said during that 30 minutes that I spoke because they had the handout, the worksheet. And guys, guess what? At the bottom of my worksheet, I always put my information, right? That they can find me here or they can download this new additional bonus. Or I also, sometimes I put my, my coaching packages on the back of the sheet so they can see what I also have to offer. So there's a lot of opportunities with the worksheets. These are really powerful things. And inside the Lady Boss uh, Dump You Marketing um, service, you get the worksheet. And this is something that would normally, you know, people pay for, but this is, this becomes an easy additional source. And people would pay for this because that worksheet is a powerful thing and it's very transformative. So strategy number three, number three, Create strong promotion and follow-up. Now, this is where some of us sort of fall to the wayside. I know when I first started, you know, promoting, and you have to promote a lot, I mean, honestly, but you don't want to be over-promotional. You, you don't want to be sleazy. You don't want people to say, gosh, I wish this girl stopped posting these things. I'm getting tired of seeing. You don't want it to be like that. You want it to sort of be a very subtle way that you're promoting what you have to offer and that you're also providing follow-up because I don't know about you guys, but I forget stuff, right? And you have to remind me constantly um, about things. Even if I put them on my calendar, I still forget stuff. So uh, strong promotion and follow-up is essential. So how do you create a strong promotion follow-up? And I know, guys, this is a lot of text. So, you know, don't try to read it. I read it for you. But number one, you want to plan for promotion and follow up right from the start so that your promotional efforts feel professional and cohesive. So basically, before you start to, 
you know, promote your webinar, you need to plan what, how are you going to promote it? Where are you going to promote it? What type of um, other content are you going to use to promote this? You don't want to do this as you are, like, you don't want to do it as you're building the plane. I think that's the saying, right? You want to go ahead and have this already ready and done for you because if you're trying to do this at the same time of creating the webinar and you're going to try to promote it, you're going to get so overwhelmed and it's going to be, it's you. You just don't get overwhelmed, believe me, because I've done this and I don't want that to be, you know, something that you do. But the other way that you want to, you know, uh, promote your webinar or workshop and include follow up is to send out social media posts. You can also, you know, you can post on social media, let people know. But I think another thing that people miss out on is blogging, right? Blogging about the topic and then, you know, very soft sale at the end and say, hey, if you want more content or more information about this topic that I just wrote about, check out, join me on my next webinar. The blogging can also be part of your newsletter. So some of you who might have a list, uh, an email list, then you can actually send out a blog post and then, again, softly promote at the end of that, uh, uh, that blog post or that article that, hey, join me for my next webinar. And so the third thing is that you want to be prepping your attendees, informing them about and educating them on their need for the workshop and webinar. So you want to give them benefits of why they need to attend this workshop. They want to know what it is it, you know, what's in it for them, right? Not about you, but they want to know why I need to come. You know, tell me why I need to come to your webinar. So you have to prep them to let them know that they don't want to miss it. So those are the three things. Now, luckily, my Lady Boss members, you guys already have this. You have the done for you promotional content already inside of this month's uh, package, marketing package, which included three blog posts and which you can use as uh, if you don't blog, it's OK, but I know you should have an email list that now you have content that you can send to your list about branding. And so the blog posts or the articles are, are around the topic of my webinar. It's not the same content that I'm gonna share in the webinar, but it's additional information that people can use and, and read through and that they can use it when, that they can read through to want them to attend your webinar. So this becomes like an enticement tool. So these articles can be used on your blog and or they can be used inside of your newsletter, the weekly newsletter that you send out, right? Maybe some of you are struggling sending out weekly newsletters. Well, the blog content of these articles that I've already created for you, right? They are about 500 words or more. All you gotta do is copy and paste them into your email service, and now you've got content on a weekly basis. Weekly, guys, that's big, right? And so also the, the articles that are already done for you, you can pull out key points from the article, so you can copy a couple of the key points and use them in your social media posts, and then just you know very softly say, hey, if you want more information like this, join me on this week's webinar, Click the link and join, you know, for you to sign up. Another way is that this is a great way or inspiration for your live streams or your recorded videos. Now, let me tell y'all a little secret about this. If you guys follow me and read my blog posts, you know that I, if you, if you watch my videos, you might watch my videos, but not go to my blog. But if you notice, my, the content that I blog about is the same content that I do in my video. And maybe some of you listen to my podcast. My blog posts are my podcast, right? I literally, I used to just read my blog posts and they became my podcast. So that's for the person who is auditory. So you can use these articles that are already done for you in so many different ways. So many different ways. Is that helpful? That, wouldn't that make marketing your webinar so much easier when the content is already done for you? Well, clearly, it's inside the Lady Boss Club. And for my Lady Boss members, you guys know that these three posts are already there that you can use, you can change, you can revamp, you can use them wherever and however you want to as your own so that you can get more people to attend your webinars and your workshops. Oh, and here's a little bonus. 
with these articles, you can package them up and turn them into a, a ebook if you wanted to. Just call it something else. Or you can call it brand like a boss and package it up. And now it's a, a little ebook that people can pay you like $5, $7, or maybe it's a lead generator that you can package up. Guys, the, the opportunities are just wild out there, right? So an additional also inside of the Lady Boss member, you get done for you social media graphics. And so in the, the Lady Boss uh, done for you marketing packages, they all come with uh, 10 social media graphics that are pulling content out of the articles that I provided for you. And I created these social media graphics that you can post on your, uh, on, your on any of your social media platforms. So the social media graphics are quick tips. They're reminder posts to let people to join. They're shareable. They, you can share them on multiple platforms, on LinkedIn, on Instagram, on Google+. Do people still use Google+. Google Plus? I think so. You can share them on, Insta, uh, on Pinterest and, of course, on Facebook. Um, the webinars, I mean, the social media graphics are um, little information that comes from the webinar but doesn't tell a whole lot. It just, again, is a way to entice people to attend the webinar. So when you post these graphics with your own logo, right, because inside of the Lady Balls Club um, membership, I uh, provide a video showing you how to put your own branding on these graphics. You, when you post them, you post them, you put the little saying, and then you say, hey, guys, don't forget, I've got a webinar coming up, and we're going to go through each and every one of these strategies on showing you how to brand like a boss. And then you provide the link, right? So I'm making the job of marketing your webinar and getting clients so easy. And these graphics are very attractive. People tend to click on graphics. They tend to share them. And you can also use these social media graphics and, pad, and paid ads. I try to make sure that the text is not a lot because if you guys have ever run an ad, you know that your ad needs to be under 20% text. So most of the graphics are going to stay within the 20% rule so that you can actually use them in paid um, Facebook ads if you like. So strategy number four, number four, let me see if you guys, are, how you guys are doing. If you come across any questions, hey, Tamika, hey, Tawanda, how you guys doing? Awesome. All right. So strategy number four is you need to have an email marketing strategy. Now, I know that this can be, ugh, you got, you know, you got social media marketing and now you got to do email marketing. Yeah, guys. Uh, email is not dead. You know, some people might say that email is not dead, but it is not. People still check their emails every single day, every single day, right? And so you want to make sure that your marketing for your business, for your coaching business and your consulting business is in line where people are checking so that you can get these clients. Now, I just, I'm just telling you, I'm just trying to make it as easy as possible for you. <laughs> so, your email marketing strategy, what do you need to tell them? Again, I know this is a lot of text. I know going forward, I need to put this on several slides. This is a lot of text. But you tell them that the amazing gift that uh, they will be able to receive at the webinar, or they can download it right, right now. This is what you will put inside of your emails. Uh, you need to also share with them why they need your webinar. So you want to say this might be, this is the only time that you can get it. It's going to be free, uh, that I'm only opening it up to a small group of people. Like this webinar right now is open to everybody who was on my list and who are, you know, who follow me. But going forward, these webinars, these, well, this marketing meeting will not be available for everybody. This will only be available for Lady Boss members. Okay, so you want to show that you're opening it up just for them for this one time. So give them a reason to want to show up. Your webinar, um, your webinar is being available only for a specific time, for a limit time. You can also include in your email marketing how much time is left in which to register for your event. So you want to say to them, hey, you know, we're getting ready to start in the next 24 hours. Or uh, the, the webinar starts tomorrow. If you have not registered yet, you want to get in because I only have 100 seats. Something like that. You guys have seen this. You know, so you want to include that in your email. 
how many seats are still available and how many have already been taken. So maybe you only have 50 seats, right? Some of us can't afford the, you know, or don't want to pay. I'm not going to say can't afford. I don't want to pay, uh, you know, $200 to get 100 seats. So most of the times I keep my webinars very small. I keep them very small because I don't want to pay the $100. I'm just being honest with you, right? But I also like them small because I like an intimate group. So when they have questions, I can address it, right? So I'm being real, real, the real deal. <laughs> so you want to tell them how many seats are available. You also want to include in your emails, the webinar event might have a hashtag that you would like them to share. If they share the hashtag, maybe they win something. Maybe you actually do a drawing, you go through the hashtags and look who's posts and you say, hey, you just want an additional maybe hour coaching session with me. So that's a great way to get people to show up. Um, something particular awesome you want to also share, like once it's, you know, a specific tactic, tactic I cannot talk today, tactic that is an insider tip that you might want to go ahead and share and say, hey guys, I'm going to share with you guys, you know, exactly what I, you know, the the, the products that I use in my in my business or the products that I use or who I've hired, you know, one of the, you know, and maybe you give them a little sneak peek of what that might be to get them to actually say, oh, she's sharing this. I've got to show up for the next thing. And then the other thing in the email that you can share is uh, another particular awesome tactic or tip that you've learned during the webinar, okay, so that they will actually learn during the webinar. So those are things that you can share within the email. Now, I know, okay, you're looking at me like, my gosh, webinar, when I started work, writing the emails, they were like a pain in my butt because they were are actually a pain in the butt to write. But part of the Lady Boss Club membership, you get done for you email templates. This is a bonus. This is one of the bonuses that were included in May's uh, marketing package, which is the webinar email sequence. There were some other bonuses. But this is the one that relates to the email marketing system, I mean, email sequence. And in this package, you get the special training announcement, right? You can let them know, hey, special training is coming. I, actually, for those of you who are showing up for this special training today, if you're on my email list or if you saw this post on my social media, that is the email that you can use to get more people to show up for your webinar. You also are going to get the template of the join me reminder. People need to be reminded all the freaking time to show up for your webinar. You can you can email them, you can you know share posts, but they forget. So you definitely want to include and tell them join me. And just a reminder, we are starting in the next hour. The email uh, template uh, for start now it has been included uh, has been included inside the package also. The show up early email uh, template, uh, the last minute to all people who did not register, that template is included in that. The follow up, right? So after this webinar is over with, then what 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 email do you send to them, right? So you know, so that email template is included in that, which is the follow up, watch the replay, and then the email uh, template for a last chance for them to buy whatever you are offering that is included in the webinar email sequence. So that's seven email templates, right? That is included, already written for you. All you have to do is copy and paste, put your information in, put your link in, and you are good to go. Good to go, right? <laughs> and so this was a bonus that was included in the Lady Boss Club um, May's marketing package, okay? So if you're interested in this and you look, oh my gosh, I need to join this, then the link is below, ladybossclub.com, that you can go and check out this offer. And there's a special deal on that page. So go and check that out, okay? So strategy number five, treat your webinar workshop like an event. Don't think of it as just like, oh, I'm just doing a webinar. Oh, I'm just doing a workshop, okay? No, treat it like an event, right? Because if you did a live event, you would be, you know, you would create a, and a Facebook event, you would create an, um, what's that, uh, Eventbrite page. You, you'll be selling tickets, or if it was free, you would make people register. You'll create some little bonus gifts. You'll do all of these things. Treat your webinar and your workshop, even if it's a free one or a paid one, 
like an event, okay, essential. So this is the event page that I created for today's training. And it was something simple. This was Facebook, right? It was just a simple event bright, event bright, Facebook event that I created. And when people join, you do know they get reminders about this event. So think about that. This is another way to follow up with people so that they actually show up for your webinar and workshop. So realize that your webinar and workshops events can be a rich experience, a very experience, rich experience. So treat it like a experience for people. So real quick, I want to you know recap on what we talked about today. And again, let me see if you guys have any questions. You are free to ask me at this point. I would love to address them. I got my phone out. So I can make sure if you guys have any questions for me that I will. Let me refresh my page. And I'm gonna make sure. Awesome. Okay. So a quick recap. As you guys know, my Lady Boss Club members know that this is all in today's packet, right? This month's packet. You get the PowerPoint slide, you get the worksheets, you get the three blog posts that are like 500 word plus for each article. You also get the webinar email sequence template. Um, you get the social media graphics. The other thing that I did not include on this page was the presenter outline to help you uh, actually know what the exact, uh, what to say exactly during your webinar. So you don't have to stutter. You got all the words and the content that you need to. So if you're not a Lady Boss member and you're interested in this, go to the ladybossclub.com and check out the offer. Right now, this is a new charter member price point. So you definitely want to go check it out. Uh, there's a special bonus that you can go ahead and try it out for a, a dollar for the next 14 days. That's a super duper deal so that you can download everything. Just to check it out, see what's available. And then if you like it from there, then you can just pay the monthly fee. But go and check it out. Go to ladybossclub.com and check out what is included in the Lady Boss Club Marketing Service Membership. Guys, you're going to love it. It's done for you. Everything is done for you. So how to increase your webinar and workshop attendance. One strategy, one, you want to make sure your topics fizzle. Uh, strategy two, you want to include a high value bonus gift and those are the workshop or uh, worksheets uh, you also want to create strong promotional and follow-up and so that's going to include the um, that's going to include your emails and that's going to include the, the social media graphics that's going to include the blog posts that are all included inside the lady boss club um, dump you marketing membership so strategy four was the email marketing strategy. And you guys saw that I include the webinar uh, sequence email template. So all of that, all you gotta do is copy and paste and put the link in because everything is done. All seven email templates are included in the bonus so that you can just copy and paste. But that's all for my Lady Boss members. And then strategy five is that you wanna treat your webinar or workshop like in a live event, okay? It is, you put the effort, you know, to put it together and you want to create an experience for people. So treat it like an event. So with that said, you know, if you guys got any questions, let me see if you guys got any questions before I enter. I am free to address those for you. So I'm checking. All right. So I'm going to take that as if some of you have questions afterwards, then I will definitely address it then. So I'm going to take it that I did a really good job, right? <laughs> um, but again, guys, if you're interested in the Lady Boss Club um, information, the dump you content, go to the ladybossclub.com. One of the things that I've definitely done with this is offered it at a very affordable price for my, my business coaches and consultants so that you have the content, the marketing content that you need to propel your business, get it off the ground, 
and not and over and not be so overwhelmed with all the things that you have to do to market your business. I've provided this for you. I've made the process a lot easier for you so that you can get clients. And so if some of you are working nine to five so that you have a resource so that you can actually market your business the right way to the right people. All right, so guys, I want to say thank you for joining me today. And oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you for joining me today. And I'll be talking to you later. Peace out.